What's up YouTube? This is Alec and today I will be showing you how to display your iPod on your computer without using VNC. Okay? So <clears throat> the first thing you will have to do is go open up your internet browser, go to apple.com, okay? Once you get to apple.com, click in this little search bar and look up Safari okay after you look up Safari click on the one under products okay after you do that it will have to load you know, at, like any other thing will sorry it's a little bit slow alright then you want to download Safari 5 it's a free download okay after you get that downloaded and you know you get the link or you get the shortcut on your desktop you want to open up Safari okay you want to click on the little bookmark page okay and you want to stop right here it'll take you to history you want to stop and wait Okay, because then you need to go onto your iPod. Whoa, <laughs> onto your iPod and open up Cydia And uh, my iPod's moving a little faster than the one on the screen. So if I start to get ahead of myself, uh, just listen to the words and don't look at the picture. Okay, then you want to go search. Click at the top, type in screen splitter. S C R E E N S P L I O oh, wait L I T R. Or you can always click it. Just take an easy way out. Um then you want to install screen splitter after it's done installing. It will be It'll usually go to the last page, but I have mine right here. It's this little app, okay? So then what you want to do is turn Screen Splitter on, okay? To turn it on, all you have to do is click on the app. It'll open up for a few seconds and it'll close, okay? But that means it's turned on because you'll see the little on bubble above it. Okay, then you want to go back to your Safari click on bonjour and then there will be your iPod with this little logo on it alright double click that this will open up and then there will be a little message that pops up on your iPod it says this remote view request that's that's just requesting your computer to access your iPod just go ahead and press accept and there you go you have your iPod on your screen and you can have as many windows as your computer can take before it crashes now I'm talking about because there's too much RAM running not because there will be a virus on there or nothing uh, so there you go so uh, that's it thanks YouTube uh, rate comment subscribe uh, friend me if you want to. Alright, bye.